So Bapu, when you're a patient, is there a time you like to go to the doctor? Chris, I don't ever like to go to the doctor. Uh, <laughs> no, I mean like a time of day. Do you like to go in the morning or the afternoon? Oh, I, I prefer the morning, but honestly, I just do whatever is convenient uh, when I'm going to the doctor. Uh, and even when I am the doctor, I would just tell patients to come when it's convenient. I don't think that there's a particular time of day that I would recommend. Yeah, whether you're a doctor or a patient, the priority just seems to be get in the door and, and get what you need. Uh, but what's fascinating is this new study that just was presented at the American Society of Clinical Oncology meeting. And they found that when a certain type of cancer treatment called immunotherapy was given at different times of day, so in the morning versus the afternoon, it actually impacted cancer patients quite substantially. Yeah, I saw that study and it was really shocking uh, to me. You know, the way that cancer survives in the body is that it's able to evade the immune system. And the way that these therapies work is that they unlock the body's immune system to try to identify that cancer as being foreign and attacking it. And uh, what was surprising about this study is that they actually found a survival benefit to patients who were randomized to receive these therapies in the morning versus later in the day. And to me, that again was uh, something that I wouldn't have expected to see. I don't know, what, what did you think about it? Yeah, I think then there's this question of what's going on here and why did they do this study in the first place? And so there is existing research suggesting that our immune systems have circadian rhythms, just like many other systems in our body do that function differently at different times of day. So if you want to test that, you do the randomized trial. And this is actually built upon other studies that just looked at treatments that were given at different times of day that also showed these associations between uh, longer survival and morning treatments. You know, this, the study got a lot of attention. It was presented at this international meeting. Uh, it hasn't been peer reviewed and published yet. So I think next steps are we would want to see what happens to that process. Uh, what do other people think about this study? And then the second thing is, if it is published and, and the findings seem to be valid, it needs to be replicated. Because if it were the case that something as simple as giving a, a patient with cancer a particular type of therapy in the morning might impact survival, uh, that would be really uh, an enormous thing to see.